how will history regard people like Liz Cheney and Adam Kinzinger? Trump's not a conservative. He's an authoritarian narcissist. They basically call them out for that. All of his tendencies are, you know, basically where narcissism takes him, which is whatever makes him popular, or makes him feel good at any given moment. And he doesn't think in classical liberal conservative terms. He thinks in, in an authoritarian way. And he's been able to get a, a, a big chunk of the Republican base to follow him because he's the culture warrior. And so I think Adam and Liz stepped out of the flow and called it out. And, um, you know, paid for it, paid for it with their careers. But I think, again, back to my earlier point, I don't think you can be really very good at these jobs unless you're willing to lose these jobs. And there has to be some line, some principle that is so important to you that you're just not going to cross so that when you're brushing your teeth in the morning, you look at yourself in the mirror, you like what you see. I think Adam and Liz are brushing their teeth liking what they see. And I think there are a lot of people in Congress, good friends of mine, who would take the vote back if they could. I think there's a lot of people who already regret not getting them out of the, out of the, out of the way when, when they could have.